It's not as hot here today for some reason. And I don't have to have the fan going. Yesterday was a beast. The next step in our project is to take these two liter bottles and cut the ends off them right there. Now start like this as you do you. Hold up. Hold it right about the mold mark here. You could do this with a utility knife or even a handsaw, but I just find it easier to do it like this. Let's go over here and try it. Now one thing I forgot to do yesterday after I drilled all these holes out, I forgot to drill in my sending bit. I know the Dremel would be faster, but my Dremel's on the fritz and it's only just one speed and it's super high. I'll help secure them by sticking them in the hole and you need the natural thread that's on here maybe thread them through hopefully ow I hurt it myself yeah I did a little bit of damage Okay, I'm back. We need to get bandaged up a little bit. Ah, stupid mistake. Now, the theory behind this is just like an air hose. When you have a nozzle on it, you spray, shoot air, and the air compresses down. And as the air gets compressed down, it gets colder and shoots out. That's why the air on the air hose nozzle is usually cooler. Now this, you stick in front of a fan, and the air comes through here, and it's just through the small part. And by theory, it should be colder. Okay, now well, let's see if this thing actually needs to do well. As you can see, I'm kind of sweaty, kind of hot. So I can't wait to see if this thing works. Yeah, actually, 